you, I, I ended up being a musician, and I still am an active musician. Um, but I really, I, I took up when I kind of left off after art school about seven or eight years ago, and they and took it much more seriously. My main influences when I was at art school were abstract expressionists, and, and the, just these these kind of things always they, they always stimulated me. Um, and so I, I, I basically I kind of followed that path rather than in figurative art, which I, I, I love figurative art, but my absolute passion is in abstract. I put on an exhibition um, of work I had done over the past year, but it was based on uh, puzzles, uh, sequential puzzles. My brother uh, does uh, he's very good at doing puzzles, I'm rubbish at them. And he was very good at doing these numerical sort of sequential puzzles. There was always one one space for clicking, it's like a square with, with numbers in them. So I, I changed the numbers, because I'm rubbish at them, I changed the numbers into abstract shapes, which means you could never get it wrong. And I called them Cosmos instruction consoles, like you would move a piece. It's just the idea that uh, you're being instructed by something in the universe to change the sequence of these shapes. There's never a. It's not a preconceived notion of how these things turn out. I don't have a plan as such of as how the, these things will work out. So, so therefore, my, the, the whole point of what I'm doing is that it asks more questions than it answers. I can't honestly say what the the meaning behind something is. That will probably reveal itself far, far further down, if there is a meaning at all. Uh, all, all I know is that I'm, I'm, I'm driven to make these images. Laterally, uh, I, I don't think uh, I'm reacting against anything. I don't see. I actually don't see the point of doing anything that is against anything. You do things that are for things. Um, I suppose it's a kind of spiritual thing. That I don't know. To me, it's, it's, it seems like a bit of a waste of energy reacting against things as opposed to doing things for something. What I do, I, I do with a lot of love and a lot of honesty. Um, if people get it, they get it. If they don't. It's, I can't force people to, 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 to come with me on this journey. I, I have to go, and I have to go on my own. It does take me to some very strange places, but it, it's something that I love and I really believe in. And I think, you know, eventually, when I'm dead, they'll all catch up. <laughs> <laughs>